Alright, so we did a couple heavy sets of incline bench. Not the strongest day. I don't necessarily feel my strongest. Angel less than three weeks out, so of course he's not gonna feel his strongest. But uh we doing whatever we feel like we, we can handle. Um, you know, we, my training style is kind of like a progressive overload thing, but we don't get carried away with it. We're not like taking notes, you know, uh, keeping like a training log or nothing like that. We kind of progressive overload if we can, but we go by feel. So if we're not feeling strong and we know we're feeling weak, like we're not gonna try to do more weight than we usually do, you know, that, it don't make sense. So I'm not gonna say, I'm just gonna force my body to do more weight every workout, no, I mean, if I'm up for it, if I feel how I should be feeling, and I know how I usually feel when I'm feeling, feeling strong, then I'll go for a PR. If not, I, I kind of know my lane. So I hit uh, I, uh, three, three and a 35 each side. I don't know how much weight that is. I guess 365 plus 20, that's 385. I hit 385 on the incline for like three reps maybe. So, I mean, that, I, I'm, I'm not the strongest right now, which is fine. Uh, so I went down to three plates and had a back down set. Now we had dumbbells. I felt the 125s honestly didn't feel as light as it should feel, to be honest with you. So I don't know if I'm gonna be able to hit like 150 though. So I'm gonna just go up and go about feel and see what, you know, what I could get and that'll be that. Be smart, don't get carried away with the lock book or progressive overload to the point that you do something stupid. Be smart. Got it? Yep.
right, guys. Just got some posing in. I try to pose, man, at least, what? Well, I pose every day, but I try to get, you know, some posing under the good light at the gym. Go through my mandatory, go, go through my, uh, my pre-judging routine and really squeeze and feel it and try to find the right angle. And I try to feel myself so I know how I look. So, you know, when, I'm, when you're on stage, you don't get to look at yourself. So this way I can pose, make some critiques and change on my own posing and uh, fix that for the next video. So yeah, got some posing in and uh, about to get some cardio in. So this video is coming to an end. Thank you guys for watching my video. Man, I love this whole process, man. I honestly love making YouTube videos. It's just a little inconvenient because I do have a lot of work to do throughout the day. Sometimes it takes me a while to get to editing videos. But that being said, I, I do love putting on content, man. I mean, I love the feedback I get. Every once in a while you get some dickheads, leave some stupid comments and, you know, off season, you don't even notice it. But pre-contest, you get a little irritable. So sometimes you can like focus too much on some negative, not focus too much, but let it uh, upset, not upset, it's not that deep, it doesn't upset anybody, but like you might respond to a negative comment where, you, you know, usually I don't respond to any negative comments, but sometimes in prep you just want to, you just want to say something back, I don't know. Listen, I welcome all comments, you know, because sometimes negative comments start, you know, spark conversation between other people, so, you know. I mean, everything has its place. I mean, you can't expect everybody to just agree with everything you do, right? Some people say, oh, half reps, look how he trains chest. Well, I mean, I wouldn't say half reps, I'll pay maybe three quarter reps, but that's how I do things. I mean, you don't want to do it that way, don't do it that way. I mean, it's not that deep, you know? Don't be pressed. If that's how I do it, obviously, it must be working for me if I continue to do it that way, right? If it wasn't working, I'll probably change it. So I'm going off on a tangent. At the end of the day, thank you guys for your support. If you guys like this video, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on Instagram at babyfall on Instagram. DM me for coaching at babyfall at iCloud.com. Turn on the post notification bell, man. Turn that, turn that post notification on so you can get notified when I put out videos. Uh, I do want to grow my YouTube channel, man. I, I, I don't always stay super consistent, but it's something I do enjoy, man. And, uh, you know, share with your friends, leave a like, it does help with the algorithm. Leave a comment, whatever you want to say, good, bad, ugly, just whatever's on your mind, leave it in the comment, you know what I'm saying? So, do that, and uh, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace. Games.